What happens if you're asked to make a statement to, to the guards? Well, you should get legal advice. Um, the reality is that when any case has been investigated, guards, much the same as every other police force everywhere around the world, London Met, NYPD, LAPD, New Orleans Police Department, if you look at the various different, um, I suppose, reports on those different police forces over the years, one thing comes through all the time. The police automatically think you're guilty. So the starting assumption is you're guilty. Here's where we are here. Let's work back from the part where you say I'm guilty to the beginning. So they, 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 they start at the, at the end where you admit that you're guilt, that you're guilty rather, and then they go work backwards. It's never a case of where they look at things dispassionately and objectively and kind of look at all the evidence, including the stuff you're going to tell them in an interview and conclude maybe rationally that maybe this person didn't do it. When you're coming into a, into a guard station or a police station anywhere, the working assumption that they have is that you're guilty and they want you to admit it.